talk to me. Welcome or welcome back to my channel it is your girl Lachelle Trends and since as you can see your girl has a new do like I girl I ain't playing I am not playing it's about to be the springtime and we have to re-up on our units so here is another unit this is a wig review slash install video if you couldn't already tell this unit is from Sam's Beauty I will have them and this unit linked in the description box below if you enjoy this video don't forget to give me a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already on my channel I do hair videos fashion videos as well as playing makeup so go ahead and join the gang and don't forget to hit that notification bell so you can be notified of each video I post. So your girl, let's jump into it. Okay, sis, so again, I received this unit from Sam's Beauty and they sent over this unit right here. So we have another sensational butter lace unit and she's looking cute by this little picture or whatever. So let's see, girl. I'm excited. Again, y'all, I have been into sensational lately. Oh, girl. I have really been feeling their wigs lately, but what I'm not feeling is this security to try to get her out of this package. Every time, it never fails. I always have trouble. We're all tangled up. Okay, here we go. Girl, the curls, the body, she is definitely cute. Okay, so what do we have? We have Sensationals Deep Wave 20 inch in the color two. It's virtually HD lace that's undetectable. Um, what else? It says human hair premium fiber blend, full body movement, uh, blends with most skin tones, five inch deep hand tight parting space, pre-plucked with baby hairs along the hairline, and natural and full maximum density. This is the stock card, and this is the unit. One more time for these curls. The curl pattern is so pretty. Okay, so let's get into the construction of the cap. So here she is. As you can see, the baby hairs are hanging, if you can see it. Okay, I'm about to say, are they? Because I thought I saw them. So yeah, they're hanging right there. There is the five inch deep parting space. And then in the inside, you can see the ear to ear lace. It's like maybe, girl, a half an inch, if that. But yeah, it's a little bit of a, it's some room. But yeah, there goes the five inch deep parting space. And then here are the combs, two on each side, as well as a comb at the bottom along with adjustable straps so girl again one more time for the curls we are looking very just girl voluminous is that the word i'm looking for like it's a lot of volume a lot of body so yeah let's go ahead and put her on so i'm starting off by putting my wig on no lace tint no wig cap none of that i literally been doing this method for maybe a couple of weeks or a few weeks now and it's been working great if you want to use a wig cap go ahead as well as lace tint i just feel like it's just a waste of my time because it's a five by five part but you do you boo and yeah to glue my lace down i'll be using my got to be glue free spray per usual and then i'm just gonna blow dry it in afterwards so because this unit was slightly tight on my head, I'm only going to glue it down maybe like a 5x5, five 7x7 by five, seven by seven type of circumference. If you want to glue yours completely down, go right ahead. But again, just for my comfort, I'm only going to glue it down a little bit and leave the sides out. But yeah, now I'm just cutting the lace. As I cut, I'm going in like a jagged type of cut. I'm not just cutting it straight across, just trying to make it look more realistic. As you can see, my lace is fairly white, or not even fairly, like, sis, it's white. 
<laughs> but yeah i'm gonna go in with my black radiance contour palette we're going to go ahead and tint the lace a bit after i get it to my liking i'm gonna go in with some more got to be glue free spray and just spray around the areas that i sprayed previously and then blow dry it in one more time and this is just gonna make the lace melt in my skin Now for styling, I don't know what happened to my clip of me like cleaning up the part, but I cleaned up the part prior to me putting this wax onto the hair. So yeah, this is just my wax stick and I'm just placing that along the parting space just so I can go in with my hot comb and lay everything smoothly down. As well, I'm going to do the same things are the same steps in the front put the wax on and then flatten it out in the front with the hot comb and again this is just to have everything as flat as can be y'all i kept going back and forth with this hot comb the wiring was short and it just kept going on and off on and off so i didn't get to lay it as flat as i could so i just start going in with my um, brush my edge brush just laying it flat and just I don't know just making it look cute in the front but I did go back and forth between the two just so it can lay flat how I like it now for these baby hairs you guys know I have been on this minimal baby hair journey lately and I have been loving it so I'm just gonna take out a little bit of hair I'm not even gonna curl it like I normally would back in the day I'm just gonna swoop it over it was it is a little harder maybe I should start curling it again because it is harder for me to swoop it over you're gonna see me do this time and time and time again trying to get it to swoop over to my liking so next time I'll probably curl it but yeah I'm just gonna swoop it over with my got to be glue free spray a part of it did not swoop over and then a part of it was because um, the got to be glue wasn't enough to hold the hair down nevertheless I got it to finally slick down the way that I wanted it to so I did the other side and repeated the same steps so now that the baby hairs are slick we're gonna clean up the front a little bit go in with the hot comb get everything flat one more time and then i'm gonna go in with some more um powder just to blend that in from where i made those parts because it, it was looking a little you know not blended so now I'm going in with my oil sheen you know I live by this I'm gonna show you the side by side if you don't use the oil sheen versus when you do I live by this again y'all you really need oil sheen with this unit so make sure you do not skip this step but I'm just putting it throughout the hair and yeah you see it you see it Okay, sis, so this is what the unit turns out looking like. Real cute, a lot of volume, as you can see in the curl pattern. The core curl, girl, I can never talk. The curl pattern is so cute. But anyways, let me go ahead and turn around so you can see the back. So that was the back sis. Let's go ahead and push her back up to the front. So let's get into these details. So first and foremost, I want to say this is, I'll 
probably give it a Be Care Friendly uh, pass just because I didn't struggle to put it on. It is a little tight on my head. However, I just want to say that I haven't been wearing wigs like that, so maybe I'm not as used to having a unit on my head. I literally just be wanting to take them off immediately after putting it on my head just because I've just gotten used to not wearing wigs and just wearing my regular hair my regular hair my real hair so yeah maybe that's it because i didn't struggle but again y'all it is a little tight on my head as to why again um i didn't glue the sides down right here i just kind of left them out or whatever but i'm not mad at it because y'all already know your girl loves a good five by five unit nobody is really gonna see i mean unless the wind blows or whatever but we're good it's only glued from right here to right here which was the area where the hair is plucked at so yeah we're good so i'll give it a big hair friendly pass um the texture of the hair y'all the texture is very I'm not going to say very rough, but it is a little rough and it is dry. I noticed that immediately after taking it out, like it does have a lot of volume, but it is on the drier side. So this is one of those units where you do want to add that oil sheet in. I know sometimes I'd be like, it's really your choice, but the oil sheen adds moisture. This is definitely one of those units where you do not want to skip the oil sheen or any type of uh, moisture that you add to your wigs. If it's oil, whatever your preference is, add that to this unit because it'll, uh, um, and give us some moisture and it really needs that moisture because it is really dry and these curls girl you want these curls to stay intact the drier uh the curls once you get into the environment it's just gonna mat up and it's not gonna be like you know cute um but besides the dryness it is really pretty hair the more you comb your fingers through it the bigger it's gonna get uh, so i kind of just comb my fingers through it barely uh just a little bit i didn't go too far into it because i don't want that big hair i think it's gonna expand once i get out into the environment anyway um but yeah it's just very big and fluffy as you can see like y'all the curls is bomb the only thing about the curls is that the curl pattern is a little wonky like right here that part just keeps coming up so you do need to just comb it down and or if you want to put a comb through it maybe the curls uh will kind of like lay themselves down and because i didn't do that maybe that's why because girl little pieces just keep coming up like this and i'm like sis what is going on like they're not uniform they're literally just everywhere but it's still a pretty um curl pattern and pretty hair and just very voluminous like i just love the curl pattern um and the length the length is nice too y'all again it's 20 inches the length is just perfect y'all just very it's just it's cute um the lace the lace melted nicely again y'all it's only pre-plucked from here to here and that's where i glued it down once it wasn't plucked or whatever and it was just giving hairline um i didn't glue it down at all so right here is where it started giving hairline and i didn't glue it but where it was plucked right here where the five by five you know is i did glue that part down and it laid very nicely it looks really good um it blends in with my skin sensationals lace is always bomb um anyway but it blends in with my skin really good i did have a little bit of a hard time to get the uh baby hairs down but to me that's to be expected just because i told y'all that this hair was kind of rough when you have that good hair it's just like not too silky but just right the baby hairs lay down so smoothly as you can see my baby hairs keep lifting right here on the side i even added a dab of um of my wax stick just so i can add that wax so the baby hairs can stay and as you can see they're lifted normally um i just know that the hair is good whenever the baby hair is laid with just my got to be glue free spray and that's not the case with this but i'm not saying that the hair is bad i'm just saying that the hair is uh, on the rougher side but besides that everything is everything like the unit is very pretty i didn't add any um uh stuff to my part any powder to my part i should have did that but in overall i think it looks really good y'all i think this unit will last maybe two weeks and i only say two weeks just because of the texture of the hair and the curl pattern i just kind of feel like this unit is kind of going to be a little matty and a little tangly right now i'm not getting any shedding any it ain't your fingers can't roll through it you see that so no shedding 
but the tangles you're gonna you're gonna hit a few snacks and only because again y'all it's just really dry hair but overall it's a pretty unit i'll have it linked in the description box below don't forget to like comment share and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and i will see you in my next video bye